so today I'm going to do a review on a bidet attachment. I've never used one in my life. I'm super excited to do it. Uh, we're going to check out the ins and outs about this thing and see how much pressure it's got. And to see how much pressure it's got, we really need to get up close and personal. Now that we got our safety gear on, let's get down there and take a close look at this and just see what that baby will do. Holy shit, that thing's got some power, y'all. Okay. Now all I gotta do is just turn the valve and it'll squirt my sphincter. The water's gonna come up and kiss my starfish. Yeah. All right, here we go. <laughs> it was a cold blast of water there at first. Now it feels kind of good. It's just barely, barely tickling my butthole. It's giving it little gentle kisses. I only have it on the first setting. It goes way up from here. I don't know what happens when you turn it up, but we're gonna find that out too, because I'm I'm curious. I gotta know. I get sick. Woo! It hit my ball sack, it hit the back side of my ball sack. <laughs> Alright, let's turn it up some more and see what happens. Oh my god. Oh my dad. Who is your daddy? I wonder what else you can do with a bidet. Oh yeah. Let's brush your teeth. Why not? So all you gotta do is get your toothbrush, stick it down in here, not in the toilet water. No 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 no, don't do that. That'd be gross. Take your toothbrush. Get it in there. Get that toothbrush nice and wet like. Get it all wet. Get toothpaste on there. So now some people stick it back under the water when they brush their teeth. Yeah, that ought to, that ought to do. Oh yeah, that just happened, yeah. So, what do you do when you gotta rinse your mouth then, I wonder? Hmm, let's just see here, shall we? All right, let's do it. Open sesame. <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> 